Well, hello there. Okay, I'm going to show you something that's really interesting. Um, first of all, this thread is a couple dollars at the store, and it's 100% polyester. But this is about 150 yards. This is about 3,000 yard spool. And you can buy these at Walmart or sewing store or whatever or online. And this is commercial thread. This goes a long, long way. It's way, made way better than this. This one's by Maxi Lock. But you can buy whatever one. Um, that's standard sewing machine thread. And uh, this stuff's great. Some big commercial spools won't work. The big giant spools like using industrial. Um, they won't work on a regular homemaker machine that you buy like at Walmart or something. And so, to get away from this, um, which will save you so much money if you're doing curtains or you're doing uh, a lot of piecework, you want to use this. It's so much cheaper. This is like like $3, around $3, sometimes 4 Um, instead of buying this for a couple bucks. And like I say, it's 3,000 yards about that um you can go to the dollar tree and you can buy a paper towel holder this paper towel holder see that now this one's kind of short for a sewing machine so you want to try to get a tall one because you gotta feed it through so it's the height of the machine so what you'll do is, you'll put like a ring, make one out of a garbage tie, or the best one is a, a key ring. And um, just tape it in here, or tape it in here. And then you put the thread right here, or here. Um, or you can put it down here, but you have to have something to hold it. Like a piece of doweling or something um and then another one you can do is make a hook this is actually out of one of these this one the pin was broken right out of it there's a pin and the thread sits there but these will go in here and then you got the pin, and then you've got the thread, and then you turn that that way, and then your machine's over here. And um, you tighten this screw up, the little set screw there, to get it all in there. And those pins are somewhere. Somebody stepped on that one or something. But you can make a hook out of a hanger. I was telling a girl this the other day in the sewing store. Um, you can take a coffee can. Um, plastics, okay, I guess, but coffee can would be better. And you take a nail and hammer in the middle. And, um, if you can get a big coffee can, it's the best. And a hammer in the middle, and it'll make a big, tall thing to go on the top. And glue that in. And then you can put some rocks or heavy items inside. And then close this up. And then you have this mounted in. And then you can run your thread on a separate thing. Like you can make a little wood thing. Or you can glue one of these on even and empty one of these spools. Just glue it on there and you slide the other one right on top of it. And that'll make you a cast off for your sewing machine. Um, these are nice. This is a good heavy duty one. This is different than the ones from Walmart if you see them on there on occasion. I don't know that they can create those anymore. And then I sell this one. It's steel. Which is super nice. And I'm only drop it on the stove because it'll crack it. <laughs> it's not cheap. See, this one has a little pin 
this is the thing that's supposed to, to go in here and that kind of and this is steels like it's really more like cast iron and um this pin can go here or here or you can run two casts off and then this will go in here and you tighten this screw up and the thread goes here and this goes Here and then you thread it through your machine. See, and that is the better way to go. See, and that is about an inch taller than this other one. But this is all metal, and this will last you a long time. That's the way to fly. But you can you can glue gun that pin in. Or you can just leave it loose. This would probably be for one of these. But or you could screw this into a, a table, like an industrial sewing table for cast off. And there you go. And that's the way to do it. So if you need one, check us out at the website, showgirlltd.com. And uh, these are very, very nice. And um, this is your next best thing, these little plastic jobbers. Uh, and otherwise, just go to Dollar Tree and buy a paper towel holder. That'll work. All right. Talk to you later. Hope you have a great one.